welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we are the voice inside your head. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I'm Mike the Explosive One. We're playing a Legend of Zelda. Dude. Tears of the Taken King. The last one wasn't all that interesting. It was the intro, right? It was just some intro stuff, yeah. But this is it. The first thing we're doing is skydiving in a dress. I guess I could have done this on the last episode, too, honestly. No, <laughs> it's better to start than this one with it, man. It's flying in a dress. <laughs> oh, my God. How much better could it get? I Hyping it today. Honestly, I'm already in love with TransLink. I'm kind of into it. I mean, whatever it takes. Whatever is Link's favorite, man. So, like, a lot of these islands are hard to make it to. Yeah. It looks kind of like... Oh, yeah, shorts on under his dress, too. I mean, I would hope so. What if they, the first thing in this game, when they didn't, he didn't have the shorts on, just had you all up his, like, his junk's just fluttering in the wind as he's falling here? Like, that's kind of a weird shot to start the game out with. <laughs> I'd probably take it back to the store. <laughs> Accelerate. Oh, I was pressing the wrong R. No matter what, you hold R, you don't die. All right, beautiful, beautiful. Can I get up on? I can get on the lily okay. pad because your stamina is linked to how long you can swim, and then you just drown. What the hell is that? Look at that lily pad and that water, dude. That's nice. Water does look pretty good in this game. Funny enough. Yeah, it really does. I kind of want to know what the smoke stack over here is. I mean, that's probably a good. Uh, what? Good, that's probably why it's there. Maybe. It looks like they Is want... Is there Kuroko seeds in this? Looks like they want me to go this way. <laughs> uh, you know, like the little... Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, and you had to like talk to the guy, and he's like, give me back my seeds. Yes, yeah, so the Karo, uh, the Karo seed little villagers are back. Oh, that's funny. They are back. Is that a... Is that a sky dragon? Yeah, didn't they have that in the first one? It's more like a eel. He's just kind of chilling that there, That dragon too. we had at the... Korean barbecue was gross. That dragon we had? <laughs> we had dragon at the Korean barbecue? <laughs> Don't you remember? We did not eat dragon at the Korean barbecue. Dragon is not a real food. They don't exist. We, oh. we, wait, what? <laughs> I like how the tree branch is more powerful <laughs> than, the, than the sword. I know, right? I'm about to equip that bad boy right now. Uh, no. I, I didn't was, mean to throw it. I, was, I mean, I was just kidding. We didn't eat dragon. What? <laughs> You know, okay, we didn't I, th eat I thought that maybe there was some behind it. Like you, maybe you had something I no, didn't have. No, the squid have. was gross. It might as well be a dragon. <laughs> Weird <laughs> rubber. Yeah, I don't like meat that's like chewy like that. Can you call that meat? Not like rubber chewy. It was like it was like a it was like you took like a sheet of rubber and you just cut a square. And you're just like, here, put this on the grill, bro. Yeah, just grill that, grill up that hunk of latex. And then it just like roll. It did that thing where like if you have a poster board and you put it and you wrap it up with a rubber band, it did that thing where just the edges roll under it. Yo. So it was just like this, like it rolled up into like a cylindrical, unopened tube of squid flesh. <laughs> <laughs> and we tried to bite it, and it like would just like, ew. It didn't like bite. You couldn't like bite your teeth through it. You had to like. Hello. Oh, hey. Hello. Well, that's an interesting looking enemy. It's a Zonai, I think. <laughs> Zeke! They're making Zeke! Your, they're making your fight with a tree branch? Stole your branch. Didn't I, boy? Get beat. You hit me. How dare you? Oh, get worked over like a part time job. Oh, uh, you got a soldier construct horn. I did get a soldier construct horn and a Zonai charge. This is the same game. It is, uh, there are some very, uh, stark similarities in this and the last game. So these are, we got the same foods, and then we have, uh... That's cool, though. No, I mean, bits. like, it gives you familiarity, but I know you can do more stuff. Like, you can build, and you can, like, do... So, which is, so it's like... So, what they did, what they did in this game is the way you interact with things is different. And we, we have not even hit, Began like... Began to scratch the surface on that. Yeah. There we go. I just can't wait for, like, after we get through the initial playthrough here, and then you, like, just start playing on your own for a while and, like, just exploring the map, and you come back and, like, look at this thing, and it's like, oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. 
with the, the uh you get the majority we're gonna get the majority of the powers that we're gonna need in this game i will happily take an apple we're gonna get those pretty early on okay um, within within the first like 10 episodes we'll have everything done because we do shorter episodes uh to keep it moving but we'll, we'll definitely have all the all the abilities your basic abilities mm -hmm. and there's some really cool cool stuff going on in this game yeah, I've seen very. I've watched very little online. I uh, I've seen a little bit of it. I saw that you can like do some different stuff, like you can like dig through rocks and build stuff, and like building stuff is a big part. Yeah, you can make rafts or make contraptions. Can't you make stuff that drives and stuff too? Essentially, or it has like a, mo a makeshift motor. We we yeah, there's some pretty some pretty intense stuff. A lot of a lot of people already know about that kind of stuff. Link, I've waited for you. Princess Zelda left something for you in my case. Oh, that's so nice. She left her gang cell phone. Maybe she should have kept that so I could call her on it. <laughs> this is a pura pad. Uh, it, it's told to be an invaluable tool that will provide you with direction. Nice. Nice, nice, Mr. Bond. What do you got for me here? This is a, this is definitely me talking to Quigley or Al. Purapad. Princess Zelda left your cell phone so you could uh creep Hit her, her up, up, dude. You can hotline bling her. Alright, so to open a Purapad is the minus button. I received from Princess Zelda, I have now passed it on to you. Uh, my records indicate that Princess Zelda is waiting in the location marked on That's this so map. That's so nice of her. My message has been delivered. Where am I, though? We stand in the Garden of Time. What? The Garden of Time? That is the Temple, Temple of, of time. time. And it's visible from here. It's used in distant past, many, uh, like, ceremonies and stuff. It, they were held there. They did magical stuff there. But no more. But now more. it's lonely, dude, like my bedroom. <laughs> Ooh. I get to touch it. I'm gonna touch that thing. You find Princess <laughs> Zelda. Nice main quest. <laughs> yeah, find her ass. All right, so we can open up our map, and that gets us our map. Oh man, that's big, like it used to be. Yeah, and then that's our quest. So we have to find Princess Zelda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The funny thing is that you think that's big. Yeah, yeah, right. Until you do this. But the other one was giant, man. I mean, brother. <laughs> so <laughs> this big. is what we're looking at here. That's and we think this is big now. That's I don't. What she, yeah, that's what she said. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know if it's as big as the last one. To be honest, I don't know if it's bigger or smaller. But I just know it's that. That's that's I a lot. I would imagine bigger. All right, we're I just gonna guess. we're just gonna collect up. It literally is like the same game with new areas and like a lot of the same inventory stuff. But like, yeah, a lot it, of a lot of the systems are still the same. It, well, I mean, to compare it to Borderlands again, it was like Borderlands One and Borderlands Two were like the same game. Except for like it was like a new area and you had like new abilities and it was but it would play very much the same and it fixed the stuff that was broken and make the stuff better that sucked. I would say is that this game is the way you interact with things like in certain games like a Borderlands, your in, your tool of interaction is a gun. Right, right. This one, your tool of interaction is still hitting things to kill enemies, but the way you interact with the world is completely overhauled. And where you had none of that in the last one, you just had like powers you could do. And maybe you had like your time what do you stop. Mean you that you had... can interact with it. Like, what can you do with it other than chop it down? You're going to have to see, man. <laughs> I'm not, I don't want to spoil anything for anybody at home okay, watching. I don't want right, to spoil right. things so, for like, you. So, like, you're saying but it isn't just you can just chop it down now. There's a lot more going on, All right. Man. I, I, will, I mean, I'll lot. take it. Like, I mean, yeah, you don't want to spoil it. That's fine. Yeah. I, uh, it, I mean, I want the surprise, too, I guess. I, so. was, I was pleasantly, pleasantly surprised. I've only... Now, I haven't played a lot. I've played past, like, the first area until I got... Uh, actually to the Temple of Simon, that's all I know. So we're, we're going to speed through a little bit. Hello. You're new, dude. <laughs> Be wary of uh, soldier constructs as you travel this way. Soldier constructs? Oh, no, they do things to tell us to stop. They do, man. They have strict orders to protect it's, this land. Zonai cops. The, Zo the Zonai Gestapo directed yeah, them to eliminate the trespassers. SWAT. Uh, they consider you a trespasser too. You must be considering a threat, and that's just my advice. 
Don't do it, because I want to do it, too. The crucial is to maintain the proper distance. Yeah, I've noticed that. And not haphazardly swing your sword. Thank you for sharing that with me. All right. Oh, but I actually not attack. Don't attack me or anything, though, bro. I don't want. I don't want that smoke. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, let's use this for now to break these, because I know it's going. There we go. Apples. Thank you. An apple a day keeps me at bay. All right. We're out of here. You're just gonna sit here and prune trees. That's what's that's what's out in the streets. Good to know. Oh, I think we got another dive jump. So there's like a sound mechanic. If you see like that little purple thing, that lets you know if I'm making a lot of noise, and then you can actually. Oh, like, so add a, the crouch mechanic. Yeah. Mechanic. So it's like a Metal Gear Solid. Yeah, yeah, a little, a little <laughs> stealth mechanic in Zelda there. Zelda Solid. Hello. I have made it to the next level. Oh, that's nice. Thank you. I'm here. You're welcome. Pick this rock up and throw it. He's strong. Throw this rock. <laughs> throw it in the water. Oh, that's a good feeling. Yeah, I mean, why is he so strong? He's like a man and a little, just a little man. <laughs> he's just like a, he's just a little guy. He makes me feel like a woman. Hello. Uh oh, they're ready to get you. Yeah, come on, I dare you. What are you doing? Okay, okay, I see you. Zeke. <laughs> Oh, you double hit him. Look at that. Zink! Oh, that is a double hit weapon, I see. I don't know if it's the weapon or if it's the attack I'm using, but I do know that jump attack is invaluable. Mm. It's like, chak chak. A chak chak chak. Okay, so I'm not going to collect any more stick or any more uh, wooden sticks. I'm going to look for only... Heavy sticks. Or yeah. The wood oh, no, I don't want tree branches. I only want wooden sticks at this point. All right, so we got we got like a whole area, man, to explore here. I'm not exactly sure uh, where where I need to go next, but we're gonna get there. All right, well uh, we'll find that one on the next one. Beautiful, so, uh, man. Beautiful. Yeah, cool. That's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe for uh, Jonas. TNT. Yep.